it's me. Um, I wanted to do a short video on what I have been busy doing. Last night I uploaded a video on um, this uh, loaded file folder that I had made. And um, I noticed when I played it back, it came out all mushad. I just, that me it's just, it was a mess. It was just a total mess. So I'm gonna try and like do a quickie to show you what this actually looks like, what I have in there. And, and show you also what I've been up to. It's a snowy day here in New York and uh, there's no school. Snow day! And my kids are actually still in their rooms. They're teenagers. Um, so I figured I'd do a little crafting, pot roast is up, um, and I just wanted to show a little bit what I've been making. First thing, I made another um, purse charm. And this is for uh, someone special. And um, it's, it's just ridiculous. It's so chunky. <laughs> I am not a very plain person by any stretch of the imagination. And I mean that um, as an insult towards myself because I i am loud and everything I do is glitter and, and bling, and but I like it. It's me. And sometimes, perhaps, it kind of fuses into what I make. Sorry. But anyway, I think she'll appreciate this, though. Um... I have uh, pink and uh, glittery white, and um, they're all glass beads that I got at Michael's on a silver chain. And actually there's two chains in here, and then the bottom uh, focal piece is pink. And this is to be used on a purse. I know sometimes when Marianne and I do uh, craft fairs, people are like, wow, that's so nice, but what is it? So Mary Ann started putting them on her pocketbook to display, which I don't know why it took us so long to figure out, but, um, and she does a dynamic, a dynamic job, much, much better than me. But anyway, so this is what I made for somebody. And this is, I did a video a couple days ago about a bag I found online on YouTube. Somebody purchased it through um, at, at Target. I forgot her name, but anyway, I, I of course had to get the same bag because I, I have, oh, look at this. It's like ridiculous. And this is the purse charm I have on it. I figured it would add a little color and, and metal, you know, because I, I mean, I am, have this filled to the gills. So that's, that's what purse charms are for. But of course you can, you can put them, um, almost onto anything. You can put them onto zippers. You can use them, um, Marianne puts them on her rear view mirror sometimes next to her big dice. I'm <laughs> kidding. She doesn't have a big dice. She does have a big Italian horn. Um, no, no, she doesn't. Back in the 80s, I think she did with her eye rock. She's going to so kill me. Anyway, um, we're both Italian. We both, you know, did our thing. Um, so, yeah, so she, she puts them from her, she hangs them from her rear view mirror and it looks nice. It doesn't obstruct your vision at all, I don't think. Or you can just put them anywhere. You can even, you know, hang them from a necklace if you want. You know, your neck will hurt. But anyway, enough of that. Uh, I made this bracelet uh, real quick. And again, like I told you, I make these bee charms in advance. I have a whole bunch of silver metal and gold metal like hundreds so um i figured out i was going to do purple and pink beads with the silver bead caps and sorry um with the silver bead caps and then um i tried to use the and serenity serenity creations uh she used these in the on her stretchy bracelets um, but my, the holes in my um, beads are too big, so they're kind of going over it, but it's okay. It's a stretchy bracelet, and again, I got, I got inspired through Serenity, Serenity Creations. Stretchy bracelet, it's with stretchy um, string. I forgot what you call it. I have it somewhere over here. And then I put another chain onto it, so it just, my nails aren't done. I'm sorry, guys, but this is how it looks. I thought it was cute. Something, something different. You know, I don't usually do bracelets like this. I usually do my bracelets on memory wire or bangle bracelets. Um, so that's also what I made today. So I made this this morning and this just earlier. 
And I just wanted to do a quick recap on this, and it's it's not it's not going to take long, I promise you. So this is obviously what the outside looks like, um, the back. I showed a video yesterday on it, but I realized that the top half got cut off. So um, I'm just going to open this up and show what is inside. And I, I feel like that guy in that, what was it, Tool Times? Remember that, the guy that would go over the, the fence and talk to him? Anyway, um, so that's what it looks like. And I told you I was gifted um, these uh, beautiful Tea Time tags from Tea Time and Dolls through a swap through Tamika. Um, and uh, I also said that I got this frame uh, from Tina from Starting Over. And it's all included in that other video that I did. And this is the back. I did a loaded bag and I put some stuff in here. The theme is supposed to be um, pamper yourself. And that is that. So I'll be crafting most of the day because tomorrow Marianne and I have our craft fair so we will be doing a video on that. I have all of the same stuff that I usually sell because I didn't, we didn't do too good at that last fair. So um, I have a lot of that stuff still to sell. And um, Marianne, she has new stuff. I'm hoping she will upload a video and just show some of the stuff she's been working on. And, uh, and that's that. So as always, thanks so much for watching and um, follow through and we will show you our video tomorrow for our craft fair. Thanks, bye, blessed.